Well, this Twitter thing, right? Like, they never suspected that someone like Elon was going to come along and buy Twitter and then, in an unheard of tactic, have a bunch of journalists review everything in all their Slack meetings and all their emails, look under the code, look under the wiring, under the machine, and find out how it was actually running. Yep. And why? I mean, the fact that anyone would ever think that any of this stuff is a good idea that people don't understand like the dangers of censorship. They don't understand what where this leads to. Yeah, well, we're seeing a little bit of that emerge on the right now, you know, which is kind of frightening to me. So I, I'm an admirer in many ways of what's going on in Florida, you know, with DeSantis. But him and Rufo, who I also think has got a bit of a clue, are trying to, what would you say, limit or even ban critical race theory. And the problem with that is you can't define it, right? Right. So how do you... How do you control something you can't define? And the answer is you battle it out on the battleground of ideas. Because as soon as you start to try to define it and then try to censor it, well, first of all, that's just going to grow because that's how those things work. You know, like where does, where does critical race theory shade into Marxism? Well, who the hell knows? Where does Marxism f f shade into socialism? Well, that's an even harder question. Then where does socialism shade into, you know, just being on the side of the working class? Well, all that's fuzzy beyond belief. And so once you get to the point where the government has to step in and regulate, say, what education systems are doing, you're already in deep trouble. And because it can't, I don't see how it can really be done because I, I can't define critical race theory. You know, I mean, more or less, you can get some sense of the cloud of ideas that's associated with it. But, but trying to draw the lines, how are you going to do that? And then, of course, you enable inevitably no matter what your goal is to begin with, you're going to control a certain form, let's say, of pathological communication, misinformation. That's just going to play into the hands of people who like to censor, and that's just as likely on the right as it is on the left. Mm. So, no, it's a real dangerous game.